Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? If you're new here, you're welcome. For those that already know me or know my channel, welcome back. This is the shop. This is the denim shop. And uh, it's morning. We have just come. So what do you do when you come to the shop? First of all, you make sure that you arrange, arrange the shop. So that's what I'm gonna do with you guys. Arranging the shop. I'm making sure that everything is very, very nicely arranged. So those shirts, I'm putting them there. Those are denim shirts. I'm putting them there. These are denim shirts, as you can see, denim shirts, denim shirts, denim shirts. So I'm going to hang them up here. I'm going to hang them up here. Like that. Any, any work that you go to when it's morning, you prepare. If it is an office, you dust your desk, dust your, dust your seat. You don't just go and sit on a dusty seat. So, again, this is actually a video. There is no work that goes on here in my office. And uh, this is the job that God has given me. I don't have a better thing, a better job. And I love it. God gives me this one. I do it very willingly and without hiding because it is mine and it is supposed to be done by people. So I do it without hiding or not showing people what I do. You know the other day it was like, okay, if you show us on the internet your life, then we know you. Okay, we don't know where you work. And it is not important that we know. It is later it seems, it seems bad to show your work. Office. Maybe you cannot go there with a the camera and start showing people. Okay, this is the office where I work. But you shouldn't hide either. If it is an office and you're working there, it's God that has given you that job. So me, as for me, I appreciate my job. And God has given me this job. I sell denims. And this is where I wake up to get my daily bread. A season will come when I wear denims all through. It's a casual. So um, I'm not supposed to wear this way, but why, why I wear this way is because there are times I don't go back home to change in the evening when my time comes to work. I leave here to my destination, my working destination from this place. So I leave home armed or prepared to go and walk. Which I like so so much. I like walking so so much because it helps me at 50 to cut my weight or to maintain my weight at 50. <laughs> I'm very proud to say at 50. I don't hide my age. I can display my ID card here and show you that I am 50. It's a blessing to be alive. So at 50, I work. I don't come and sit. I come and hustle. And uh, let me remove this cake because it makes me feel hot. I I like looking this way. Uh, I, was, I like wearing it from home because in the morning it's a bit cold. And uh, there's a lot of light. I'm noticing a lot of light from there. But you guys will understand. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of light. So, um, there are times... There are times, there are times, there are times. There are times you feel like, uh, oh, this is a shirt dress. This one is a shirt dress. This one is a shirt dress. You know, guys, there are, there are shirts and shirt dresses. You know, a shirt dress is a lady's outfit that you wear and you can wear it as a dress. Yeah, as a dress. <laughs> as a dress. You don't need to have something else inside so like this is a shirt dress you see it's long enough ragged down there on the sleeves 
very fashionable for those that wear those ones. Let me tell you guys, it is for those that wear those ones. Don't you ever sit and think that you can wear anything and look nice? Do you know there are outfits you can wear and you are like, oh my god, you just sat on these holes. Did they look at themselves in the mirror? There are some outfits that you can wear and what people wonder whether you actually look fine because they are so amazing. Because they will wonder mm. if you surely wore that from home. So, uh, it's not every outfit that suits everybody. There are some that uh, will make you look like When you are arranging the shop, you have to check the colors that fly. Colors that go together, like nowadays, can suit me. You see, guys? You see? Then, this one, it's off white, or oh, it's washed. We call it washed in denim language. This is a washed, washed denim wash. So I was talking to my man, I said to me, a customer that came to a skirt, and uh, I had to listen and speak in that French, German language, German, 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 Yes, I'm telling you, there are some difficult customers, a customer will change, we have a changing room here, they will sit and sit and sit and say, what should I buy today, and go home, then after a day, we see them doing the dance. Her change until she's uh, satisfied because a customer has to be satisfied. Customer satisfaction is key. So, guys, I'm um, feeling like we're going to do work with you. I'm working with you guys because uh, right now. I'm still hanging this shirt. And uh, I was actually for 40 years I hung and saying every job, every job that you do, there is no job that you go and sit down and not even arrange your desk. Maybe you are so senior that you cannot touch your desk to arrange because there are people who arrange for you. And then you are very, very fortunate. You should thank God for that. Because there are many people like that. I'm not disputing that. What I'm saying is uh, if you are just a person, a regular person like me, what you do is when you go to work, you arrange your, your, your location, arrange your, your desk, and make sure that it is neat. So in this case, I don't have a desk, but I have a shop. So in the morning, I come and arrange and make sure that everything is in order. Order. <laughs> everything is in order. <laughs> oh my God. Make sure that everything is in order. I come to you now. Arrange, arrange, arrange before you sit to wait for customers. There are sometimes that we sit. Guys, I've done videos while I sit here waiting for customers, then they don't come. Why lie? Hey, never lie. There are times you wait for customers that don't come. You wait and wait and wait. You can even pay. God forbid. God forbid that you can go home. And because it has happened, that's why I'm saying God forbid. God forbid. May God always provide unto his people. And that is why our Lord's prayer is very, very important. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. Lead us not into temptations, but deliver us from evil. 
for thy is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever the lord's prayer it's the lord's prayer that we can even lead us in this By the way, may I preach? <laughs> no, let me not preach. But let me tell you this. When we pray, we tell God, give us this day our daily bread. Our daily bread. Why don't we tell us to tell God? Provide for us, God, a bread for today and for tomorrow. You know, God, I don't know what I'm going to eat tomorrow. Even the other day, oh God, I pray that you give me uh, food for the other day. Two days from now, even next year, God, what will I eat? No, we don't tell God that. We tell God, give us this day our daily bread. This is because we need bread for that day. For that day, daily bread. Daily bread. Because God knows, he's the holder of tomorrow. He owns tomorrow. By the way, God owns tomorrow. We don't know if you'll be there tomorrow. He owns tomorrow. So give us this day, this day, our daily bread. We only pray about today because tomorrow is not guaranteed. But if you learn that you wake up on phone, at least it is guaranteed. So, it's there at the end of the day today. Okay? When we meet, we are free of time for this day. So, when we go to the house, this day, our daily bread, it is not our bad thing to pray. It is a good way to pray that God gives you daily bread, that day bread for that day. So, guys. Always remember that you're only guaranteed yeah, to poor. Guaranteed yeah, to poor. You can a denim. You yeah. can a denim. Yeah, a dress. Uh, yeah. Your dress is denim. Do, dress denim is not just hapa. Yeah. Yeah. It's not fair size. No, no. no. Mm. Mm, that's how you customer. And it's a good When it's a fair yako. It's a good come na e. Yeah, come na e too. Ata ni tatoka ni kuwache umuzi. Eighteen. Eighteen. Dress not any eighteen. Are you bargaining? I'm done. Are you the one who's buying? Sini ah, customer di anunua. Yeah, yeah. So what are you worried about? Sini kumwambi a bay. Anunua. Sababu yodi a bay yetu. Yeah. Don't bargain for the customer. Bring the customer. Nta kuwa ndoke ya. Ata ni yende umuzi. Yeah. It's a laughing matter, you know. <laughs> we call them brokers. They go and get customers from out there. Then they, they, they come and tell you, give me this and that dress I take to a customer. And here I'm telling them, no, go and bring the customer from here. I'll even leave my shop and stay aside as you sell for the custom, to the customer. As you sell to the customer. But that is not possible. I cannot leave my shop. Uh, I was just trying to pass a message that he should bring the customer here and I give him his commission. That's the way we survive, guys. Survivors for the fittest. They are the ones that are out there in the, in the field. And this is a... A denim shop, so they, they get a customer asking for dens, denims, but I maybe I may not reach that customer because I'm in here. So what they do is they come, please give me a denim dress, I go and take the customer. No, go and bring the customer here. That's the way we operate. <laughs> That's our way of survival. That's the way we survive. So they're just randomly coming in as I do my video. They don't know that I'm doing the video anyway. So it's the way of survival. So guys, it happens that sometimes we have some jungle green ones. They come in the, they come out from the same package, of the denim package. So you may ask, where is that jungle green coming from? It came from the package, the same package that we, we opened for denim. We call them bales, the same bales, the same bale that I opened. It produced even the denim, the jungle green, jungle green. So we still sell the shirt. It's a shirt anyway. Guys, let's get, I think God has and I just believe that we can ask for our daily bread here. Let us not worry about the bread for two days. Let us ask for daily bread. Daily bread. Give us this day our daily bread. Daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses. May God forgive us our sins. Because we have sinned against you. We all 
Vamos a ver qué así que es. Si no, no, así no, 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 And falling short of the glory of God. We are all sinners, guys, on, on this earth. We are all sinners. So, guys, I'm keeping on a rage in this place. Now I'm through with the shots, and I think I'll end this video here. And, guys, did you remember to subscribe to this channel? For those that haven't, uh, it's my request, my humble request, humble request that request that you subscribe to this channel. Kindly request, kindly subscribe to this channel, and um, I think I should only ask you to subscribe. But watch the videos first. You know, watch the videos because even if you subscribed without watching the videos, the, the, the subscription is going to be removed. At least watch the video for one minute. But my request is that you watch the full length of the video, watch the video till the end, and then subscribe. And when you do that, you will have done as good. Because your subscription is going to um, support this this channel so kindly subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one remember to work with god always bye catch you in the next one bye bye